God the Father, for those born into pagan families, through no fault of your own, I will grant you mercy. Monday, September 16, 2013 at 4.20 p.m. My dearest daughter, the human race is, to a large extent, impervious to my existence. So many know little about me, their father, their creator. My sacred servants, including all those who believe in me, the creator of all that is, have failed to prepare humanity for the punishment which will face them if they do not acknowledge the error of their ways. A desire to believe that all will be well has meant that many of my children do not believe in the existence of hell. This is a place where people who refuse my mercy, my intervention to save souls, go. Mortal sin, unless it has been erased through reconciliation, will lead souls into the abyss of hell. Those who may not be guilty of mortal sin, but who do not believe in me and instead believe in an existence which has been created and fabricated in their minds by false idols, have much to fear. Reject me, your creator, and you will turn yourselves against me. You will cut yourself off. Many of you, when the truth of my divinity is revealed to you, will fiercely oppose me and nothing I do will save you from the fires of hell. I can use every divine power, but I can never force you to accept my mercy. Nothing, only the prayers of chosen souls, will help you. This means that you will never see my face. Anyone who tells you it does not matter if you do not accept my existence is lying. Only those who accept me, and through the mercy of my only Son, can enter my kingdom. If you are a kind and loving soul and still reject me, even when the truth is made known to you, you, too, will also be cast away from me. No eternal life will be yours. I grant the gift of purification upon all of you now, but in particular to atheists and pagans. This purification will be painful, but in many cases it will open their eyes to the truth. For those born into pagan families, through no fault of your own, I will grant you mercy. But for those of you who were given the Gospels and who know about the existence of the Triune God and who now reject me, there is little hope for you, until you turn back and atone for your sins. Then you must beg for the salvation of your soul. Your Father. God the Most High.